Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Since the majority of us are going back to school soon or have already started, I wanted to share with you four DIYs that are great as desk decor and organization. I personally like doing my schoolwork in a well-organized space because it helps me stay focused. I hope this video motivates you to do the same. For the first DIY, I'll be showing you how to make a hang it photo display. You will need twine, a square wooden dowel, acrylic paint, and small clothespins. I started by marking the middle of the wooden dowel. The one I got is 36 inches long, so the middle of that is 18 inches. This is where we will be cutting it in half. Now I'm going to make marks where I'll be drilling holes through the wooden dowel. I marked the middle of the left side, and from there I made a mark every two and a half inches on both sides from the middle of the mark. I repeated the same on the right side of the wooden dowel. Once you cut it in half, you should have two pieces like this. Shout out to my dad for helping me cut it. Now I'm going to drill holes through the marks I made earlier. Make sure you have something as a base so you don't damage your table. I am using this wooden crate. Once you're done drilling holes on both of the pieces, you can go ahead and paint them with acrylic paint. I decided to paint mine black. I used this 24 inch ruler to separate the pieces, then I cut out 7 pieces of twine long enough to reach across the wooden dowels. Take a piece of twine and tape the ends to make it easier to pull through the drill holes. Make a couple of knots and cut the ends off. Do the same on the other side. Repeat this with the rest of the pieces of twine. Now you can print out any pictures you want for your photo display and cut them out. I took these small clothespins and painted them gold. Take your printables and clip them to your display. Lastly, to hang it up, I took a small picture hanger and hammered it to the back of the top piece. For the aesthetic planters, you will need small plant pots and any paint of your choice. I started by simply painting random streaks all over the planter using different colors. Once that dried, I added gold streaks and different colored dots. These are very simple to paint. I love how aesthetic they look once you add the gold and the small details. Next, I'm going to create some motivational frames. I started by painting these frames with black acrylic paint. 
I wanted them to match with the rest of the decor. Then I went on Cricut Design Space and typed out motivational quotes that I liked and cut them out on gold permanent vinyl. Once the machine is done cutting, cut the individual quotes and weed them out. Now take a piece of transfer tape and apply the vinyl to the glass. I wanted my frames to have a white backdrop, so I cut out pieces of white cardstock. Last but not least, I'll be showing you how to create your own DIY acrylic calendar. All you need is an 18 by 24 inch acrylic sheet and black vinyl. On Cricut Design Space, I added the days of the week and some lines to separate them. I attached everything together and cut it out with my Cricut machine. Cut the excess vinyl and weed out the design we created. Remove the plastic from the acrylic sheet and apply the vinyl with the help of transfer tape. Before arranging everything, I decided to spray paint the base of my desk gold and other office decor I already had.
guys enjoyed this video, I had fun creating all of these DIYs to decorate my desk area. Let me know in the comments which DIY was your favorite and if you're planning on recreating any of them. I hope everyone has a great school year. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe and see you guys next week with a new DIY.